Hello. How are you? <laughs> Welcome to Leaf Reviews again. Stay. And again. And again. Like and subscribe, it's free. <laughs> Just had a brain block there. Yeah, gang monkey chilling out, as I always do. Near the tackies. Oh, I got, oh, yeah. It reminds me. I've, I've ordered a couple of more flavours of tackies. From Amazon. So. Mm -hmm. So I'm getting, I'll get notifications all over the, all over the hockey. <laughs> there you are. Um. Anyway, I'll start off. It's, it's January the 10th, 2023. I'll go off track and then I'll lose the plot. So there you go. Right. January the 10th. Sorry, 2024. You're so used to saying 2023 for a whole year, aren't you? And then when the new year starts, it's 2024 and, it's, and you keep saying last year. Because you said it for a whole year. And it's in your head. No, you've got to change it to 2024, so I don't know. <laughs> right, anyway. Um, yeah, anyway, I was saying, I've got some new tackies from Amazon, but I'm not doing them now. I'll do them probably tomorrow. Is it it's Thursday tomorrow already? Wow. Probably Thursday or Friday I'll do them. But they're these. Salsa Brava. Um, imported from Mexico. So there you go. I'll do them. <clears throat> tomorrow or Friday we'll see right anyway hope you're all right <laughs> sorry about that um yeah I need a show um it's lovely out there today weather blue sky a few clouds in the sky but it's cold it's not as cold as yesterday but it um yeah god it was freezing yesterday because it was the wind there was a wind and it just cut you in half not literally but the wind was cold it's a saying Oh dear me. Midweek Wednesday. Yeah, there it is, look. It's five degrees today. Sunny, and then it's gonna get colder through the night. And then it will be colder next week, I think. Yeah, minus four, minus two next week. So <clears throat> There you are, right. I'm going to do a, a burger and a drink. <laughs> so, right, I'm going to do this. Speed Feast. Flame Grilled. Barbecue Rib. With a sweet and smoky barbecue sauce. This was from Lidl. The same as the other burger I did. Um, the, the quarter pounder was it or something, yeah. Uh, but this was from Lidl. It was 159 I think so. I didn't. I didn't bother doing no red onion or lettuce. I'm just going to put the sauce in and just eat it as it is. <laughs> there you go. But yeah, try this. I've done the the, the the normal stuff. I've toasted the burn. I've cooked the the rib thing there. There you go. Smells nice, but does it taste nice? Normally, when things smell nice, they taste nice. But we'll see. Barbecue sauce. I'm just going to put the. Oh, hang on a minute. Right. Be prepared, Lee. Look, there's a little tab thing there. Can I get it? I'm not going to have to use scissors. Now there you go. Just got it there. Right, um, I'll need a tea towel. Be prepared, Lee, again, yeah. Oh, and by the way, before I forget, I'm watching a really, really good thing. It's called The Serial Killer's Wife. You might be able to see it in the background there. It's on Paramount Plus. But I've got a fire stick, so I can stream it for free. So there you go. <laughs> right. <laughs> Don't know what's up with me today. I'm a bit mental. I'm a, I actually, I, I spoke to my children yesterday, which was I was happy about. I suppose, you know, because they go to school and they're busy and they're tired. You know, they just go to sleep. But yeah, I was a bit worried yes, yesterday because I couldn't get hold of them. But um, 
I spoke to them yesterday, so they're fine. And they can't wait to see me on Saturday. So, I love you, darlings. Right. Stop waffling on and just eat this burger. Not, it's not a burger. Is it, what is it? Is it a burger? I don't know. Right. This will go on the bottom, like that. And then I'm going to put the sauce on. Barbecue sauce. It'll come up this end, wouldn't it? Yeah, there you go. There you go, all over there. I'm not a massive fan of barbecue sauce, but again, I wasn't a massive fan of Bounty, was I? But then I loved it. What's that all about? <laughs> oh dear. Yeah, I, I never, again, I'll say again, I never thought, I didn't, never read. I'll start again. I didn't know why I wasn't a fan about of coconut. Sorry, <laughs> I didn't know why I wasn't a fan of coconut. I never had bad any bad experiences with it. Yeah, that's alright. Right, the sauce is on the rib, barbecue rib. I'm gonna put the top on the top. As you can see, top on the top. There you are. Looks alright, doesn't it? Yeah, so some with some onions and lettuce. Maybe some hot sauce. <laughs> right. <laughs> oh dear. It looks alright actually. Don't look too bad. The buns are nice. I've toasted them. But I didn't toast them too much. Maybe the bottom one a tiny bit, but right. Um, right, speed feast, flame grilled barbecue rib with a sweet and smoky barbecue sauce from Lidl. Cheers. Mock wavy 85 seconds. Um, it don't taste bad. <clears throat> it doesn't taste too bad. A bit dry. But um, again, if you put some more sauce with it, like mayonnaise or some hot sauce, or like I said, onions and lettuce, it'll be nice. But it tastes all right. My brunch. It's twelve o'clock. I've got um start at two o'clock today. I'm doing late because <clears throat> well I'm not late. I normally finish at half six on a Wednesday, but um it's a twilight shift, so we've got to stay till half seven, but I don't mind it. Anyway, yeah, this ain't too bad. It's a little bit dry, but it tastes lovely. It tastes nice. And the barbecue sauce is quite nice, but if you add, add more to it, like, like some mayonnaise or some hot sauce, and the lettuce and the red onion, it'd be nice, yeah. It's a tiny bit dry. But... It tastes all right. <clears throat> like I said before, on these um, these sort of um, burgers and stuff, they got so much better than um, years ago. Sorry, but yeah. It tastes nice. It tastes really nice. But look, it's a tiny bit dry. 
And I didn't, I didn't, I managed, I didn't overcook it. I under, undercooked it because I've got 900 watt um, microwave and this is for eight, 800. Chopped pork, chopped and shaped pork with, with a barbecue seasoning in the sesame seed bun with a sasso barbecue sauce. 49% barbecue, oh sorry, 49% barbecue pork, 85% pork, so that's not too bad. Sorry, picking my teeth. Um, onion, garlic, smoke flavouring, spice, rosemary, sesame seed bun. Yeah, it tastes all right. It, honestly, it doesn't taste too bad at all. Let's just have a bit on its own without the bread. Hmm. Yeah, it's only a bit dry, but again, it tastes lovely. <sighs> there you go. <laughs> Rating. Um, sorry. Again, I don't eat food fast. I'm not beard meets food or beard meets food or Leah Shukova, who's lovely by the way. But yeah, rate him one fifty nine. It's good. It's nice. It. Uh, I can fault it. It's not a 10, definitely not, but it's a bit dry, but the flavour's nice. Um, for a quick snack, you know, in a microwave, yeah, it's all right. I'll give it a 6.7 for the Speed Feast Flame Gould Barbecue Rib with a sweet and smoky barbecue sauce. Yeah. <laughs> Excuse me. Yeah, it's not bad. Right. I don't remember a few videos ago, I did a strawberry milk. Um, this one, I've still got it, it's nearly gone, it's lovely, I've got the banana one, Ta da got the banana one, sorry, so I'll try this, this is from Morrison's, 99p, it wasn't 99p, the strawberry one was 99p when I got it a week, two weeks ago, or a week ago, and now they're now, now the one pound forty nine. So they've gone up fifty p nearly in two weeks. This um, cost of living crisis is crazy, isn't it? Right, banana flavored milk. If I remember, it's got a little pull tab on it. There you go. See, I ain't losing my head. <laughs> little pull tab. There you go. Pulls off. Hmm. I like bananas, I like strawberry, I like all fruit really, there you go, yeah I'm going to eat, drink this and chill out and relax then for an hour and 45 minutes, I'm going to watch one of them, these here, honestly it's really good, it's not confusing or anything like that, it's really good, right, posh glass, there you go, Oh, sugar, I just put put that where that other thing was. There you go. <laughs> put the top on it, Lee, because if it falls on the floor, it's going to go everywhere, isn't it? Right. <laughs> there you go. Banana, banana flavoured milk. Yeah, it smells nice. It smells like bananas, and it smells like milk. I think that's all I can say, sugary. But anyway... Give it a bit of a swirl. Nice and thick. It's nice and cold. Right. Morrison's banana flavoured milk. Cheers. Mmm. That's nice. I think I said with the strawberry one, the milk, it, it needed a bit more strawberry flavour. And it's the same with the banana one. It needs a bit more banana flavour. But it's nice. You know, it's not it's not like drinking water <laughs> or anything like that. No, it's not like drinking water at all. It's it tastes nice. I just like I would like a bit more banana flavour. 
But it, like I said, it, I can taste the banana in it. There's the banana there, look. <laughs> there you go. Um, right. Banana flavoured milk. It's just past, pasteurised banana flavoured milk drink, and that's it. Um, dried milk. Um, banana juice. And that's it. I don't think it's got fresh bananas in it. I think it tastes lovely. But yeah, it's alright. Made with 1% fat milk. <clears throat> Excuse me. Yeah. Yeah, it's alright. Kids all like that. Like the weekend. Yeah. Right in. I can't remember what I give the strawberry one. But yeah, it's not too bad. £1.49. How can some go at 50p in two weeks? It's crackers, isn't it? But anyway, rating, yeah, um, it's alright, yeah. I'd like, I'd like a little bit more banana flavour, but it's not bland, it's not like drinking water, I can taste the banana a bit. Banana, so I'll give it 6.7 for that. Well, the kids will like that for the weekend, so, and I've still got some strawberry left, so there you go. Right, hope you like that little video. <laughs> oh, me, reviewing things and having a chat. I'm going to keep doing it, you know, chatting and stuff and reviewing. Why not? You know, because I was thinking about doing two things. One review and then a chat. I'll, I'll just mix it all in together. So it, I think it, it's better that way. Some some people say, just just do just do a review first, then chat after or something. But I like to mix it up a little bit. You know, mix it. Mix it in. But there you go. Right, I've got to go because it's nearly 17 minutes long. So, right, anyway. But like, again, like I said, I've had a chat, you know, and about things and... The TV, what's on the TV and stuff. So, there you go. Right, anyway. Like, subscribe, hit the bell. Take care. Do that. You know what to do. Phoebe and you my whole world. You always are. You always will be, darlings. It's as simple as that. Facts. Simple facts. And I'm your father. I'm your dad. I love you to bits. And you love me. I know you do anyway, darlings. So, and remember that. So, and I'll see you Saturday, darlings. Not long now. It's only another three sleeps. So I'll pick you up Saturday morning, down It's 10 o'clock, and I love you to bits. Right, like, subscribe, hit the bell, take care, do all that. You know what to do, subscribing's free. Then there's a little bell up there that you click that, and then it'll say all. Then click all at the bottom, then you'll be notified when there's a new video. For your good selves. So there you go. <laughs> so anyway, I'm going. Love you, I love you and leave you, and thanks for the subscribers. 400, 430 now nearly. It's gone up like 30 in about three days. So, again, appreciate that. Thanks ever so much. So, there you go. Right, anyway, take care of all the best. I love you all. And I'll catch you soon. Cheers.